Hi, welcome to my channel, Tech Easy Learning. Today we are going to see an interview question and answer. Okay. This is mainly intended for the beginners. See, we are going to see how to display the 10th record. This is very simple only. You can easily do it. For that, we are going to use the minus operator. Okay. How to display the 10th record. Here, I will zoom it now, you can easily see. Here, we are going to use the employee table and in employee table we are having around 14 records this is the first one and here 10th record is with the employee id 7844 and the employee name is turner we are going to get this record how we are going to do this we will see now here i am using the select statement select star from emp where row number is lesser than 11 here we can use either row number lesser than 11 or lesser than or equal to 10 either we can use 11 or lesser than or equal to 10 okay lesser than 11 means it's equal to 10 only then minus Select start from EMP where row number lesser than 10. Okay. I think you know about minus operator. Already I have explained in detail about the minus operator in my previous video. If you want to know that, you can go through my channel and uh, you can see my previous videos. Here also I have given some brief explanation. I will show that at the end. Okay. Now I am going to execute it. How we are going to get the 10th record from the AMP table. See, I have shown the 10th record is Turner. We are able to get that 10th record. Okay. This is the way we have to get the 10th record. How we are going to delete the 10th record, we will see now. Now we have seen how to display the record. Now we are going to see how to delete the 10th record from the EMP table. This is very simple only. After writing this SQL statement, select E name from EMP where row number is lesser than or equal to 10 minus select E name from EMP where row number is lesser than 10. We have to put delete from EMP where E name is equal to. That's it. After writing this query, we are going to after uh, selecting the record, we are going to delete it. For selecting the, for selecting and displaying the record, we have already seen it. For deleting, just add one delete statement. That is very simple. We will see how we are going to deleting the tenth record. See, I have copied the same query here, delete from EMP, or e name is equal to, then I have used the same query, what I have used in the displaying the 10th record. See, one row deleted. Now the row is not available with the name Turner. So we have got deleted the record. This is the way you have to delete the 10th record. Okay. 
already have told you about the minus operator minus operator is used to return all the rows in the first select statement that are not written by the second select statement that means it subtracts one result set from the another i have shown in the diagram you can easily understand it here 2 and 3 is the common one 1 2 3 and 2 3 4 okay 1 and 4 are the uncommon one so here we have to right that means the minus operator will return the rows that is in the first select statement that are not written by the second select statement okay by this, di by this diagram you can easily underst understand this is self-explanatory okay uh, thanks i will see in the next video okay you may kindly share and uh, subscribe my channel share this video and subscribe my channel okay.